Oh, hey there. How you guys doing today? I'm Mr. Furlong, and together we will be making a wall hanging bas relief sculpture. I will be using cardboard. Here's some important information about your assignment. You will choose one of the following themes a portrait, nature or landscape, or architecture. Create a bas relief style wall hanging sculpture using cardboard, paper, or cardstock. You should have a minimum of at least five layers and a minimum of at least 15 cutout pieces. Bas relief is a very ancient art in which a flat surface is carved or etched away to create a picture or scene. This art form is also referred to as low relief, meaning that the objects do not project very far from the background. A relief is kind of like a cross between a three-dimensional sculpture and a two-dimensional drawing. It's a technique where the image appears raised from an attached background. Relief sculptures have been used throughout history. From ancient civilizations to the Renaissance and are still used by artists today. Like contemporary artist Helen Musselwhite. Her artwork can be seen here. Let's talk about the supplies we'll need. Sketchbook, cardboard, some scissors to cut, adhesive like glue or tape. Now come up with an idea using one of those themes listed earlier. What should I sculpt? Hmm. Aha! Sketch out several designs that you might want to use. Make sure you think about how many layers you'll have to use to create your desired depth. And all the different shapes you will need to cut out to achieve this. Once you've figured all that out, it's time to start drawing and cutting out all of your shapes. The more layers you add, the more depth you will create. You can suggest a bit of roundness to your sculpture by adding smaller layers on top of larger ones. You will see me do this as well as round out the cardboard by bending it slightly for my top layers. I create my pieces layer by layer, moving from the background to the foreground. But try to avoid creating too much depth in your space. Remember, we are creating a bas-relief sculpture. Unlike a sculpture in the round, which is typically viewed from multiple angles, a relief sculpture has only one viewpoint. A bas-relief sculpture is a low or shallow relief sculpture. After all my pieces are cut out, I start assembling it in order, making sure everything is good. If everything fits together and I don't need any more adjustments, it's time to start gluing. All right, you did it. Now you have a bas relief sculpture. Congratulations. Remember to post your finished 3D art piece in Schoology and let your teacher know if you need any assistance. Have a nice day.